Hello everyone. Welcome to Informatica support videos. I am Sudhya from Informatica Global Customer Support. This demo is about reference resources feature introduced in Enterprise Data Catalog version 10.4. First, we'll see the editor for the video. In this session, we are going to discuss about what is reference resources and reference assets. What are the types of reference assets? List of scanners that support reference resources. How to create a scanner with reference resource. Viewing reference resources in EDC administrator UI and catalog UI. Assigning connections to the reference resources. And the benefits of extracting reference assets. What is reference resource and reference assets? A reference resource indicates that the resource you configured includes references from other data sources or resources. Assets from reference resources are known as reference assets. Resources configured in Enterprise Data Catalog might include lineage information and connection data from other data sources. Though the information about the data source might not exist in the catalog, you can view the data source as a reference resource when you view the lineage for the assets in the resource. For example, an Informatica Power Center resource that you want to configure might have mappings that point to tables or columns in an Oracle database. The Power Center resource is referred as a primary resource the Oracle database is a reference resource for the Power Center resource. The tables and the columns in the Oracle database are reference assets from the reference resource. What are the types of reference assets? The types of reference assets can be seen in Enterprise Data Catalog are reference data sets, reference data element, reference data source. A reference data set refers to a collection of data objects included in a reference resource. Example include uh, tables, views, synonyms and public synonyms. A reference data element refers to any asset within a reference data set. For example, a column within a table or view column within a view is a data element. Examples include columns, view columns and fields. A data source referred by a configured resource is a reference data source. For example, connections and the schemas used in the power center mappings. The scanners that support reference resources are Power Center, AWS Glue, Tableau Server, Cloudera Navigator, Apache Atlas, Informatica Intelligent Cloud Services, Informatica Platform, SQL Server Integration Service. Let's move on to the demo to see how to create a scanner with reference resource, how to view them, how to assign the connections to the reference resources. I have created a platform mapping which includes source and target tables from Oracle database using Aura demo connection. This mapping extracts first name and last name from employee table, concatenates them to name using aggregator transformation and load it into ODS tables. This mapping is deployed on application map1. I have configured a platform scanner in EDC to extract the applications application map 1 and application map 2. In metadata load settings tab, I have enabled reference resource option for this platform scanner. Select retain unresolved reference assets option To retain the unresolved reference assets in the catalog after you assign connections. Retaining unresolved reference assets help you to view the complete lineage. 
The unresolved assets include deleted files, temporary tables and other assets that are not present in the primary resource. Save the configuration and run the scanner. After the successful scan, you can see the number of extracted application and the mappings in summary section and the connections in the connection assignment page. Assume that the Oracle database where the source and target tables are present is not loaded into EDC. So we are not doing the connection assignment to this platform connection. As reference resource option is enabled for this platform scanner, reference resource gets created in EDC administrator and catalog UI to get the complete lineage of the platform mappings though the Oracle data source is not loaded. To view the reference resources in the catalog administrator, click open. The library page opens. From the library pan on the left, click reference resources. The reference resources page appears. Here you can view the primary resource, the description of the resource and the type of the resource. You can click the drop down list beside the primary resource to expand the list of reference resources. The reference resources are prefixed with the text primary resource name, provider ID and the connection name. In catalog you can view the reference resource and reference assets created for the platform scanner. Here, the reference source is Aura underscore demo, which is the connection used to import the source and targets for the mapping. Source and target tables are called as reference data assets and the columns are known as reference data elements. Now, if you open the summary view of the mapping from the platform scanner, you can see the reference data sets that are linked to the mapping to get the complete lineage. We can launch the lineage from source table. If I hit this button, orange circles will be shown. If I click on any of the orange circle, the detailed lineage will be shown for that particular flow. If we assign the Aura demo connection to the source Oracle schema and enable retained unresolved reference assets option, EDC does the connection assignment and retains the reference assets for the unresolved objects to generate the complete lineage. If you recheck the mapping, you could find the resolved tables from the Oracle resource and the reference data set for the unresolved table and the lineage will be like this. Benefits of extracting reference assets. After you extract reference assets, you can use these assets similar to how you use other regular assets in the catalog. You can search for reference resources and assets in the enterprise data catalog. You can filter the search results based on the reference resources and assets. You can view lineage for primary resource that includes reference resources and assets. You can view lineage impact and control summary for reference assets. You can filter the lineage based on reference assets. You can enrich reference assets with custom attributes and business terms. You can perform bulk upload or bulk uh, import of the custom attributes, business term, association and other enrichments on reference assets. You can also view 
custom lineage between reference resources. For more information, kindly refer the Informatica 10.4 Catalog Administrator Guide and Informatica 10.4 Enterprise Data Catalog User Guide. If you have any queries, you can write to support videos at informatica.com or twitter.com slash infosupport. Thank you.